Hey everybody, uh, this is Wesley Pepper here. This is the promo to promo video to Wesley Pepper's Art Lexia. This is episode 71, and this is the second last episode of this podcast in its current format. You know, as you know, I've got new um I've got developers working on some new interesting new technology, and um I've got a new company coming on, so that's really cool and really exciting. So look forward to that. I think I'll do a video on that as well. Um, I think I should. Um, yeah, man. Um Moving on to today's episode, today I'm talking to a very, very, very interesting guest. Uh, I'm talking to Arlette Franks, based in Cape Town. Um, and today's for uh, uh, today's episode, we're focusing not just on her work, on her processes behind her work, but her story, because Arlette has got an incredible story, um, uh, quite, quite, quite an incredible story. And she's also a whistleblower. Um, so I had to, um, we cover, we cover what she, um, the corruption in the art industry in, um, in uh, Lopopo or Mpumalanga. Um, we unpack that and look at all her story behind her blowing the whistle, um, and her art because her art is definitely a reflection on, uh, on, on her life over the past, over the past, uh, 20 or 30 or so years, um, pretty much post, um, since 1994, um, so I sort of, I try to, um, we try to unpack the whole story and try to give our, um, and we try to focus on, um, on what was wrong. As you, as you know, that the arts, um, has been, um, uh, that, um, that corruption in our, uh, the, the corruption in our, in our art industry is something that's not really covered a lot by the mainstream media. And today we, uh, we sort of unpack in that. So look forward to that and also look forward and also get catch me on all my social media platforms. That's Wesley Pepper on all social media platforms. That's Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram. Uh, yeah. And that's all for today. So, um, yeah, I will catch you next week. Take care.